Hi, I'm Hallie. And I'm Adam, and welcome to Snack Attack. Today we're trying four unique Pocky flavors. Peach. Melty chocolate. Yubari melon. And coconut chocolate. Let's, Let's get, get snacking. snacking. First up, we have Peach Pocky. This flavor was a disappointment. The flavor for the peach was very faint. Yeah, not very peach flavored. And when you smell the pokey from the outside, it, it has a strange smell that's coming from the chocolate. And that carried through for me into the taste of the chocolate as well. It was strained all around. The weirdest part for me was the actual bread stick itself. It had this odd savory flavor that didn't match well with the white chocolate. There was a milky sourness coming from the white chocolate. And that for me left a really weird aftertaste like on the back of my tongue. I did not like that at all. I am glad that I tried this, so it was worth a try for me. I now know, if I see this in stores again, that I won't be snacking again. It's worth a try. Someone might like it, but that someone is not me. Our next flavor is Melty Chocolate, which, at first glance, just almost looks like a regular Pocky. What sets it apart is a thin layer of cocoa powder on the outside. As far as I could tell, not any more melty than a normal chocolate flavor. But that being said, it did have a fantastic chocolate flavor. I really like this one. It was, it was rich, but not overly sweet, which was nice. And the cocoa powder on the outside just added a different texture, like flavor texture that felt really fun on the tongue as you're eating it. Yeah, the chocolate almost had this kind of fruity note to it. Like it had this kind of fruity sweetness in it and it was just really nice. Mm -hmm. This was worth a try and I, as soon as I see these again in the store, I'm gonna get them. I agree with Adam. Our next flavor is Yubari Melon, which is a special type of melon from the island of Hokkaido in northern Japan. They're very famous for these melons and melon flavored goods. It kind of tastes like a cantaloupe as the closest proxy if you've never had a Yubari Melon. Yes, that was my first thought immediately. It tastes like cantaloupe. And not only tastes like cantaloupe, it smelled like cantaloupe. Very fragrant. It was really good, actually. I really liked it a lot. At the end, after you kind of chew through and you're about to swallow, there's almost like a little bit of tanginess mm -hmm. from the melon flavor and the white chocolate. And I thought that was really nice. For me, it was a little bit too sweet. So I am undecided if I would try these again. Because I really liked the flavor, it was worth a try for me. But maybe I would only have one at a time. Then, then I would try it again. What do you think? Judicious. I really liked these. Worth, worth trying, absolutely. And I will snack again. Next up, we've got a nice classic flavor. Coconut chocolate Pocky. I really like this one. I think this, this was my favorite from today. It's just chocolate and coconut together on a stick. How could you go wrong? Great combination. I like that obviously the stick that Pocky comes on, it's already crunchy, but the dried coconut that was covered in chocolate, it added like an extra crunch layer, which I really appreciated. Yeah, it had this just wonderful kind of toasty, mm. coconutty flavor to it. Mm -hmm. Man, it just, I had to stop myself from eating more. <laughs> fantastic. So I think it's pretty obvious for both of us that this was worth a try and that we will be snacking again, if possible, if we find these in stores. Yes. That's it for today's Snack Attack. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what you saw, give this video a thumbs up and share it with someone you think would enjoy it. And if you have an idea of a snack or drink you want to see us try, let us know down in the comments. See you next time. Bye.